The construction bidding simulation is a, a model that lets multiple teams compete with each other to uh, bid for a construction contract from the point of view of a general contractor. The way that the simulation runs is that the students have to pretend they're assembling a bid for a construction project. And the way that it works in, in real life is you have to figure out how big is the building, what's the building made of, and then collect all these bids from various trades like concrete and walls and windows and those kind of things. And so uh, we simulate the process of, of having people figure out the quantities, how much steel, how much concrete, what kind of surface area, and then receiving competitive bids as they would come in uh, in the real world towards a, a time certain on a day when the bid is due. Ultimately, the conversation is really in the debrief. The simulation isn't that difficult. The debrief is the, is the important part. In the debrief, you can talk about things ranging from how did it feel, which usually is pretty tense. So the room gets hot and you'll walk around and it's just like in real life in the war room on a bidding situation where everybody's got their tie loosened and took their sweater off and they're trying to figure this stuff out. And ultimately, it leads into a discussion of uh, how to set up a bidding situation, which applies to any market, not just construction. And it applies to how do you set up a contract. We wrote this for the MBA class, but we tested it three times in executive education first because we wanted to see how it worked. We had some unexpected reactions from people who um, don't like uncertainty because there's a lot of chaos. I mean, it's different than your normal kind of controlled case study discussion because you don't really understand it, you don't know what's going to happen, and if you didn't really do your homework, you're lost. Well, that's kind of the teaching point. If you don't do your homework, you're lost. This has definitely met the goals that we hoped for because it's been something that's been fun and uh, stimulating and something that's outside of the realm of what people would, would often do.